A big change Prince William wants to make to the royal family, but there is one person stopping him. Prince William is keen to follow in King Charles' footsteps and work towards a more streamlined monarchy, an expert has said. Hello viewers, welcome to Royal Unlock. Please make sure to subscribe and hit the notifications bell, so you don't miss any updates about the British monarchy. Prince William's major plans for the royal family could face some serious resistance from a senior member, with one royal commentator believing the heir is keen to shrink the working monarchy, as his father King Charles is doing. The Daily Mail's Richard Eden said he had been told by inside sources that William was looking for a more European model of the monarchy, similar to those found in Sweden or Denmark. Mr. Eden quoted a source who claimed, when the elders of the family retire, his Royal Highness will not invite anyone else to become a member of the royal family. He added, it remains to be seen whether he wants his two younger children, Princess Charlotte and Prince Louis, to be members of the royal family. William, his wife Princess Kate, Prince Edward, and Sophie, Duchess of Edinburgh are currently the only four members of the royal family under the age of 70. When William and Kate become king and queen, the numbers of working royals will likely decrease further. With Prince George only ensuring royal duties. The insider explained, this is what William wants. He sees the small European kingdoms as a model for the future. However, William's aunt, Princess Anne, is not thought to be happy with the idea, as she has previously criticized the idea of a mini-monarchy. During an interview with CBC, she seemed to question whether this model was practical, given Prince Harry and Prince Andrew's departure from working royal life. The Princess Royal told her interviewer, well, I think the phrase slimming down was said on a day when there were a few people around. That doesn't seem like a good idea from where I'm standing. I'd say I'm not quite sure what else we can do. She added of King Charles, well, you know what you're getting because he's been training for some time, and I don't think he'll change. You know, he's committed to his level of service, and that will remain true. During the reign of Queen Elizabeth, the balcony of Buckingham Palace was filled with non-working royals and their families during events such as Trooping the Colour. But now, King Charles has significantly reduced the number of royal presents on the balcony and even his nieces Princess Beatrice and Princess Eugenie are no longer present as often. Royal commentator Jenny Bond showed her support for the King's plans, as she said OK. Magazine, I remain committed to the idea that a slimmed-down royal family is indeed the right model for the future. It is in line with most European monarchies and responds to persistent criticism, that the royal family